So I'm real live editing. I forgot to tell y'all that I ended up returning this vehicle. So yeah, I was really doing a rental cause I, I didn't want to put no miles on the scat. So got a, a rental. I was supposed to get a Tesla. Then get the Tesla. Boom, they gave me this little EV. I get the EV, driving around. I ain't seen no type of EVs around. Every EV, no cap y'all. I'm not even boosting it. We drove. It either wasn't there or it was not working. And I was in Orlando. So I even had to go to a like a apartment complex and I drove in a parking garage. It was saying the EV was there. The EV charger ended up not being there. When you get in, we didn't even know it was like an apartment thing where you had to put your key knob, key knob or whatever. Whoop. So we had to literally like we couldn't get out the the parking garage nobody was around so we had to lift up the dang rail thing whatever you want to call it just to get out and that's when i knew i needed to return the vehicle so i returned it they didn't have no more vehicles only thing they had was a chrysler van wasn't doing that no cap <laughs> no offense to anybody shit i didn't want to roll with that uh yeah so we hopped right back in the scat but we're gonna get straight back into the video Poppin' y'all, we in Vero Beach right now. Did a quick little day trip. Shoot, we at this little Disney Resort Hotel thingamajig. We kinda running on time right now. Short time. It's a lot of stuff on this resort that I did. I didn't even know about this resort at all. I ain't gonna cap down to y'all. 10 out of 10, not gonna lie. I only got like a one day turnaround type thing, so I'm only here for a little bit. Not too long, but we still gonna make the most of it, saying I'm on that type of time where I'm trying to be off my phone, trying to enjoy this time, trying to enjoy, you know what I'm saying, being solo on this trip. I probably should stop talking to y'all for right now because we need to go outside and start doing stuff. Thing is, I really was gonna wear a tank top and then just keep it like that. But I'm wearing this shirt just in case. I'm saying, you know what I mean? Anything go down, you yeah, I might meet my wife, you feel me? Just don't never know. You see what I'm saying? So you just gotta always be prepared. That's about right. I ain't gonna lie, I ain't really like the shirt like that. It's far, but not with this outfit. You see what I'm saying? We'll probably go tank and I'll probably change the next shirt for real. All right, that's great. That ain't too bad, that ain't too bad. I know it's white, and I know y'all probably like, you probably gonna mess that up. Nah, I probably will. The beach here, y'all, is way, way more clear than Cocoa Beach, New Smyrna. Well, I feel like I'm name dropping on folks. For real, this water is way more clear and the waves look way crazier too. Way, way crazier. I don't know if y'all can see it. Y'all probably can't. Today, I ain't eat nothing yet. I was thinking, I was looking around trying to see if there was like a plant-based spot somewhere close to here, but I ain't really find nothing. But I mean, it is what it is. For me, yo, like if I just ended up going to Publix or getting like, you know what I'm saying fruit juice or coconut water for the day. Like I feel like I'll be Gucci. You know what I'm saying? I feel like that'd be the plus side of it because I ain't really going around stressing like, dang, I need to eat. I need to eat. You know what I'm saying? I'm still be able to enjoy my time here. You know what I'm saying enjoy the beach. Yeah, uh, fresh market right now. I'm about to see if they got some quick fruit and stuff. <sighs> oh. I just 
just got from Fresh Kitchen Farmer's Market. I ain't really get too much stuff, y'all. I ain't, I'm saying I had, uh, I got some organic salsa. When I go to shop for stuff, I be looking at the minimal ingredients, but it's always better to, you know what I'm saying? First of all, I definitely should have, I'm saying, just planned ahead more. It was kind of like just last minute. So I was kind of on the go. I ain't really look around. I got some key limes with deodorant for real. Got some gala apples. I was going to eat this with this. I got some organic almond butter. This is the one I usually get. But I will say it's better to use, you know what I'm saying, tahini butter. Almond butter is okay, but to keep using it over and over again is definitely not good. But this is what I got. These are the chips I got. Y'all seen these before. You know, look at the ingredients. Pig Himalayan salt, plantains, and coconut oil. That's it. Got those. And I was eating it with this salsa right here. I ate a little bit in the whip. This is what I ended up getting. Probably ain't the best of the best, but gluten-free, fat-free, no art no preservatives, 100% natural, and then these are ingredients. You know what I'm saying? So it ain't bad, bad. No sugar, none of that either. Pretty much straight, but that's what I got for the salsa. And then the drinks and stuff is what y'all know I normally get, which is like the lake wood and stuff. Minimal ingredients, really only got one ingredient. It's not for concentrate. It's fire, I ain't gonna cap. But it's always good to juice your own stuff. This trip was tempting where I was like, you know what I'm saying? I might just go eat something quick. You know what I mean? Maybe do like a little vegan restaurant real quick or something, see if they got, but they didn't have anything, first of all. Second of all, I don't wanna go down that route no more because, bro, people be using canola oil, all these other stuff when they be cooking with, depending on the restaurant and stuff, and so you kinda gotta be so, like, cautious with a lot of stuff, man. And right now, how I'm feeling, the mindset I am right now, bro, is like, I don't wanna go back to keep going back and forth. You know what I'm saying? I feel like this last summer, still progress, but I was still going back and forth. Whether that be, you know what I'm saying? I would eat good for a little minute, then go back, fall, you know what I'm saying? Fall back to eating something I know I, should, I shouldn't be eating. I'll just put it in my Patreon. Pretty soon, we're gonna be doing like a raw uh, fast raw vegan fast where it's gonna be fruits vegetables organic everything organic of course and we're just gonna do kind of like a raw thing man where we're just doing organic fruits and vegetables for real and then maybe big salad so yeah man it's gonna be smooth man if y'all wanted to check that out my patreon is the link down below i think it's good for people just in general man even if, even if you don't join my patreon it's good in general to do like, you know what I'm saying, fast or cleanses here and there because it gives our body a time to digest and then we putting the right stuff in our body, man. So it's been on my mind for a little minute and I kind of even wanted to do it myself and it's even more encouraging that I got y'all with me. I'm saying doing it with me. So, uh. Yeah, morning, man. Checking out today, so it's like 8 a.m. right now. But uh, I'm about to go to the gift shop real quick to see what they got. I was finna hit the spa, but the spa was acting like I ain't gonna cat that, y'all. I ain't, I ain't really like a cheap, cheap, you know what I'm saying, person. Nothing against that, but I ain't really too much in. I would have spent it, but it's kind of taxing for real, for real, compared to, you know what I'm saying, if I did one somewhere else or stuff like that. So I was just like, it's all dead. But uh, yeah, we finna see what's up with the get shot. It's lit. So it's actually a nice, you know what I'm saying, spot if y'all have, if y'all wanted to come down to a fire hotel, Disney hotel and stuff. So I think the gift shop is actually the other way. Poppin man, headed right back to the crib. Bro. What I'm about to do, what I'm thinking on, bro. I think I might just go ahead and just roll with this 360 camera, bro. I'm not gonna lie, cause I feel like I'm gonna use it for traveling for sure. Like what I just did, I had some ideas, but I was like, dang, I couldn't get those. Feel me like those, couldn't get those angles or the camera would have been perfect, bro. And it's waterproof. I don't know. I think I'm gonna end up doing it, bro. That's just, just hefty, hefty price, man. And that's honestly probably why I didn't do the spa. You know what I'm saying? Because I was like, dang, if I do the, well, the spa was already expensive, but if I did the spa and then do the, you know what I'm saying, the camera, I'm almost spending close to a G in a day. So I was like, man, a little crazy though, the old me, I'd have been like, okay, boom, you know what I'm saying? Swipe, boom, swipe, boom. But I think I was, you know what I'm saying? Like, just from everything that I was going through or been through, it's like, I kind of was just like in an I don't care mindset. You see what I'm saying? So I feel like now I'm getting more mature and stuff. You feel me? And I still do like to spend, you see what I'm saying? I ain't gonna sit here and cap y'all down with that, but uh, I'm trying to be a little bit smarter, you know what I mean? Smarter, not even in no cheap way, but 
smarter and like smarter and just better decisions. You know what I'm saying? I mean, I ain't finna be cheap though. You know what I'm saying? We kings and queens. You feel me? We gonna live royalty on this earth too. That's what I'm going for. Alright, alright, alright. We are headed to Best Buy real quick. Again, I got to uh, pick up a little stopwatch joint. Doing a little sponsorship right now. So, watch is actually tough though. I ain't gonna, I can't show y'all yet. It's going to have to be on my, my main channel. But, like, it ain't just your ordinary stopwatch. So, I got to go pick that up. I got some kicks that just came in from Adidas. I had ordered some. I'm telling y'all, like, I'm trying to go everything new. You feel what I'm saying? Everything new. Shoes. I ain't trying to add a dunks no more. I'm trying to come, you know what I'm saying? Come trim on some different, you know what I'm saying? Some different pieces for real, yo. But I, I want to, I'm like, I'm at that point. I want to start having like, like pieces where, you know what I'm saying? Like, like, I feel like having main pieces, it's like you can wear with a lot, you know what I'm saying? A lot more stuff where it's like, you just grabbing pieces and it's like, you can't really wear with everything. It's like a one-time outfit. Then I'm trying to have pieces where I can wear, I mean, wear with different stuff where like, okay, smooth. Okay, boom. You did it with that. Okay, boom. You know what I'm saying? And especially with shoes and stuff too. So yeah, we doing everything new, y'all. I'm not going to lie. We doing everything new i still got a few more clothes I, I need to either sell or figure that out so if y'all wanted to i'm probably gonna end up putting on my story and if they ain't on my story it's just gonna be it i guess <laughs> you feel me because I, I definitely trying to get rid of them y'all like i don't y'all be peeping bro i got so much clothes but i be wearing the same stuff for it for just because i don't know i just like i want you know what i mean like i'm giving a lot of stuff away like I just wanna, you know, what I'm saying go go new. I ain't like the clothes that I had. I've had it since uh, Atlanta. You dig what I'm saying? So like I wanna come trim with new stuff, man. So we gonna figure that out. Yeah, I know y'all probably like, boy, what is them? What you do? Just just wait. What I'm finna put on with this, man. Okay, D jumps is hard. D jump hard. Y'all gonna see what I got going. But yeah, these are the ones I had ordered. They hard, ain't they? Yeah, I know. Appreciate it, gang. Appreciate it, appreciate it. I got a little vintage fit I'm finna put on with these. Okay. 